yo guys white out here with another video and in today's video i'm gonna be going over the best tips and tricks to help boost your fps in fortnite this is everything i've done and learned to have my game feel smooth before we get into today's episode 96 percent of you guys watching are not subscribed and if you enjoy the content consider subscribing also if you want to support me all you have to do is use my code whiteout in the item shop if we get 50 people using my code this month i will do something special for you guys with all that said, let's aim for 50 likes on this video, and let's get into today's episode. Alright, so the first thing I need you guys to do is go into your settings. Now we're going to be taking a look at your window mode. Now there's either full screen, window full screen, or windowed mode. If you're not using full screen in windowed mode, you should be doing that because Fortnite supports the full screen, and it even says in the description that the game will run slightly faster. Also, if you have a bad PC or you're just not getting that much FPS, you can put your resolution to 1600x900. Now when you put it to 1600x900, your game is going to look a little bad, so you're going to have to get used to it. But this will help out give you some more FPS boost. And now for your frame rate limit, what you want to do is cap it one above your monitor's refresh rate. Make sure to cap it at what your monitor's hertz are. So I have a 240Hz monitor, so I'm going to cap it at that. Now if you're using something like 144, you can cap it at 160 FPS, but you can also test this, you can even go to 165, and maybe this will help your game feel a little smoother, but if it doesn't, just cap it back to 160, and yeah, if you're at 200, just cap it to 240. And now moving on to the graphics quality, I do use performance mode, so not all the stuff is going to be here. Now also, if you have a bad PC and you need to get more FPS, I would recommend putting it somewhere around 66. Now do not put this below 66, because this will make your game look really bad and you don't want that, and make sure all of your other settings are on low or near okay now moving on to vsync if you have a 60 hertz monitor i'd recommend turning this on but other than that make sure to have this off and for the rendering mode i do use performance mode i have a good pc but i just like using the bubble wrap builds and yes i know they're gone but just for now i just use mobile builds okay now moving on to your audio make sure your sound quality is low as it says the high quality sounds better but you may decrease performance which means that you will lose fps honestly low doesn't really make a difference and for visual sound effects i would also recommend turning this off okay so picture the scenario in your head say you're playing trios in an end game and there's a bunch of people next to you and the visual sound effects will just keep popping up on your screen so this will make your fps go down because you have so much stuff going on on your screen so i'd recommend turning this off and these are all the fortnite fps settings that i have for you guys now i'm going to be going over a few settings that can help your pc run faster and give you an fps boost okay so this first step is strictly just for nvidia users so what you want to do is right click on your mouse and click on nvidia control panel now once you're on adjust image settings then you want to click on use my preference emphasizing then you want to put this bar all the way to performance so by putting this on performance this should boost your fps by a little bit okay now for another tip this is for anyone on pc so what you want to do is take a look at your storage settings now you need to make sure you have at least 30 gigabytes of storage free because if you have low storage left on your pc so if you don't have enough storage on your pc it's going to make your pc run very slow so if you have any clips or any games that you're not using anymore just delete them so you can have some storage freed up so if you want to get rid of some storage really fast, all you have to do is click on configure storage sense. Also make sure delete temporary files that my apps aren't using is checked. Then you can click on clean now. So this will just clean out some apps and files that your PC has never used before. If you guys want me to do a full on PC optimization video, this video needs to hit 50 likes so I can do that. Okay, in the last step for this video, all you want to do is right click on your taskbar and click on task manager. Then what you want to do is go to startup and just make sure everything under status is disabled except Fortnite or anything else that you're using. Having everything disabled will make sure that your PC is running smoother and only focusing on Fortnite, which will give you more FPS. If you guys enjoy this type of content and want to see more in the future, make sure to leave a like on this video and comment what type of videos you want to see me upload. Also subscribe if you're new because it means more than you think. Also, if you want to support me, all you have to do is use my code whiteout in the item shop. I hope you guys have an amazing day and I will see you guys in the next video.